In his offices on the outskirts of Lima, symbols and customs serve as powerful medicine. Dr. Aguila still performs the ancient ceremonies which are believed to ensure protection from the powers of evil spirits. His patient is a woman who was infertile. Though the patient is technically cured of her physical problem, Dr. Aguilar must also take into account the effect on the patient of cultural beliefs. And so, the cure begins. A long wooden rod symbolizes the healer's divine power. Apus, espíritus superiores. The rod will create a protective barrier to guard the patient from the return of malevolent spirits. A final prayer invokes the curing powers of the gods of the sun and the moon. Tú que has hecho el sol, la luna, las estrellas. In the early 19th century, when Western trained physicians began to practice their skills in Africa and Asia, they found that patients often did not respond to treatments and therapy that were effective in Europe. Increasingly, we are discovering that cultural tradition and belief play a powerful role in healing, that a patient often cannot be understood or cured away from his culture. Today, in Los Angeles, a unique program recognizes the power of culture in healing. At the Metropolitan State Mental Hospital, certain patients receive regular care from a witch doctor. Leon is a Mexican curandero. Before each curing ritual, he appeals to a great master for the power to heal and exorcise evil spirits. His patients are Mexican-Americans with strong ties to their native culture. The ceremony begins with prayer. Afterwards, Leon ritually exorcises each patient's evil spirits. His first patient, Pedro, suffers from a kind of cultural shock. Raised in a small Mexican village, Pedro's first exposure to the urban world of Los Angeles was emotionally overwhelming. Out of fear, he detached himself from reality and lapsed into a catatonic state. With all the powers he can summon, Leon concentrates on the particular spirits which he perceives to afflict each patient and works to drive them away. When Leon has completed his spiritual exorcisms, each patient receives a cup of water, which is ritually blessed and imbued with beneficial power. Water is a universal symbol of cleansing and health. The curing ritual ends as it began, in communal prayer to the spirits of health. Ignacio Aguilar is the founder and director of this remarkable clinic named Zipe Totec, after the Aztec god of spring and rebirth. In treating people who believe that mental disorders are often caused by curses or bewitchment, Aguilar uses ancient curing ceremonies to augment conventional treatment. <coughs> 
Maria suffers from a severe loss of identity and self-esteem and a crippling sense of personal guilt. As part of his efforts to treat Maria's complex emotional problems, Aguilar performs an age-old Aztec healing ritual. Smoke from fire, the visible form that all spirits take, symbolically draws malevolent forces out of her body. Aguilar commands that Maria's evil spirits go away. The leaves on a branch represent these spirits still clinging to her body. As each leaf breaks off, an unwanted spirit is symbolically cast away. Aguilar tells Maria that she has been cleansed, that she is no longer possessed. Now he tells her she is a new woman. O dentro de un momento, te quitamos esta protección que no, tienes aquí. No. For Maria, the ancient ceremony has a powerful cathartic effect. Padre mío. Uh, symbols have very important things in our lives and it's very important that we surround a patient that comes to a hospital where everything is alien to him in terms of his culture that these symbols be uh, a vivid connection in order to establish a therapeutic relationship hence the importance of having symbols like what you see on the walls and what you have seen throughout the world and what we're trying to do here is to provide treatment that in effect works to the extent that the person gets well and when a patient comes with this kind of a problem to the hospital and we provide the proper mediums, he leaves and he lives well. Familiar music is another powerful cultural tool that Aguilar uses. For the once totally withdrawn Pedro, it has provided the first step back into reality. When viewed outside of their cultural environment, the magical art of the witch doctor can be easily dismissed. Yet, in places where beliefs about the causes of illness are different from our own, the so-called witch doctor can function as an effective healer. A mastery of natural herbal remedies and the fact that most illnesses are overcome by the body's own defenses greatly aid the witch doctor's power. Perhaps more important, however, is the fact that many illnesses are psychosomatic. 
The ability to inspire confidence, trust, and faith is one of the most potent medicines of any doctor.